hi welcome to tech harvest today we are going to see how to install apache 2 in ubuntu for that first we need to update our repository apt get update so it will be updated our repository in ubuntu once it is updated we are going to download apache 2 package so it is started now So it is updated. Now we are going to install Apache apt get install Apache 2. It is asking for confirmation. Give yes. So it will download now. So it will be installed now. We will skip this line because I have some service about Jetty. So it is going to fetch from there. That in that not an issue. So now we are going to start the Apache uh, service Apache to start. Once we are started, we will check with that service Apache to status. So now I am going to check service Apache to status. So it will be started now. After installing Apache, we need to check the firewall status, which are the port allowed by Ubuntu firewall. So for that, we need to check UFW status. So for that we need to check UFW status. So the following port are allowed by the Ubuntu firewall. So now we need to check UFW list. So which are the application available. So there is following application is available. Apache, Apache full, Apache secure. So Apache means you can only enable the 80 port. Apache full means you can enable the 80 and 443 port. Apache secure means it will be allowed 443 port only. So currently I am going to allow Apache full. You have double Apache. So rule will added. Now we are going to check the status. So Apache will allowed by Ubuntu firewall. So now we need to check that host name. Sorry, now we are going to check that status of the Apache. So for that, go to etc init.d Apache 2 Apache 2 status. So it is active now. So for the 
after that we need to check the host name of the system host name i so i am going to give in browser this ip address so we will check with that so now now we are going to add the virtual host file in apache for that we need to copy this default config file so it will be located at etc apache 2 sites enable sorry sites available so i am going to copy this default file as a etc apache 2 then sites available name I'm going to give on tech harvest dot com dot com so now we are going to list of that it will be copied and gonna edit with this vi so here we need to change and also we need to add so i'm going to edit given server name Harvest dot com and the server alias so here we need to enter server alias Server alias as here dot com. So now I, I need to save this one right and quit. So now we need to enable this one in Apache for the day to enable site harvest.com.config. So this will be enable that uh, virtual file. So now I am going to enable that site virtual host file in Apache for that A2EN site techharvest.com.config given enter enabling site and also we need to disable the default site A2 this site this is the default it will be enable so we need to disable this one so the default site also disabled so we need to restart the apache server etc apache So now I am going to restart the Apache server. So 
so now I'm going to restart etc init.d inside of init.p all the services are available apache to restart So it is trying to restart. So it is trying to restart. So it will be restarted now, and also we need to enter your website name into host file. So for that, we IATC hosters and hit enter and my uh, IP is 192.168.1.6 so take harvest now we need uh, this website name as a uh, host entry take harvest dot com and seven quite written quite so now we gonna check with we started now we are going to check in browser now we are going to check in the browser so I am given the website name as here tech harvest so tech harvest dot um, given as a http double slash tech harvest dot com so because it is running in a AT port so you need to give us a http only so it will come now I am just downloading one uh, HTML template from website then I made a little bit changes on here so if you are giving IP address also it will be going 192.168.2.4 this is my IP address so it will be redirected to this so this is uh, apache 2 configuration is done now if you have domain you just go there and uh, redirect it to this this server public ip then you can uh, uh, it can available on internet site also thanks for watching please subscribe tech harvest